sometimes I don't really feel worthy of forgiveness and you know I don't know what that really means what it means to be worthy of forgiveness what someone has to do to be worthy of forgiveness maybe I'm not maybe you're not but if I'm not and you're not like who is you know what I mean um and I think that the first step to redemption for everyone is feeling worthy worthy to be on that path worthy of earning forgiveness and dirty little worm of the earth uh, I want you to know that I forgive you I don't know what you did you don't gotta tell me I'm not telling you what I do <laughs> but um you're worth forgiving because I know that you are capable of so much if you can get past this hurt of feeling unworthy and feeling like you're a bad person. You don't have to be a bad person, you know? You're not a bad person. There's so much good waiting to blossom and a lot of it already has the little ways that you've disappointed yourself and disappointed the people around you it doesn't negate all the good that you've done, okay? it just doesn't you have been through a lot and Let's be real, okay? Like, I'm pretty sure that 90% of the people over the age of like 24 uh, have plenty to be guilty about, and you're just one of them. You know? You're just one of them. And if you're under 24, you're so mature for your age. <laughs> that's okay it's okay it's still okay it's still okay I truly truly believe that you can do great things and that this doesn't have to haunt you forever it doesn't have to haunt you forever you are so special and so interesting And I forgive you. I know I'm not much. Uh, but, you know, I think I'm pretty important. <laughs> and I forgive you.
forgive you. You were loved this whole time, and you were worthy this whole time, and that your mistakes don't define you. Your mistakes don't define you. Your mistakes do not define you. We can just... okay to let all that go. It's okay to make room for self-love. Make room for forgiveness. Make room for my forgiveness, okay? Because I'm giving it to you. So you've got to carve out a little part of yourself. And for now, you can put inside there that I forgive you. And then, whenever more important people <laughs> forgive you, and maybe they already have, or whenever you forgive yourself, you can throw the me part away. That doesn't need to stay, okay? It's just a placeholder. It's just a little placeholder. But. Your mistakes do not define you. You have so much potential. There is so much brightness and so much light inside your heart, and it deserves to shine through. No matter what your past is, you have so much light, I promise. I promise you're full of beauty. I promise you have your own set of wisdom to give the world. That your lessons can be learned without always hurting. You don't always have to hurt, okay? You can learn a lesson and still be happy. You can learn a lesson and still be happy, okay? You can learn a lesson and still be happy. You can learn a lesson and still be happy. Click, 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 click. 
you're good. You are good. I believe that you're good. I believe. You're good. I believe that you're good. I believe that you're good. I believe that you're good. Let's take the self down. Make sure that we leave a lot of room behind it. For forgiveness. So take the self doubt to make room for forgiveness. 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 You are forgiven. We are all wretched. We are all small. We've all disappointed people. Okay? We've all disappointed people. We've all kept secrets. We've all reasons for shame. And he said that art, art for the artist, should never be therapy. <laughs> Clearly, I disagree. I believe that art has so much potential to heal both the consumer and the artist. Um, obviously, I think that ASMR is one of the most therapeutic art forms to create, and also one of the most therapeutic to consume. hasn't been on my hand this whole video. I don't even know what it is. Whatever this thing is. I... The 
believe that you're worthy of healing. And if you want to heal by making art, by making ASMR, do it. That's what I do. Sometimes my art is therapy. I'm not gonna say it ain't. Sometimes it's not. Sometimes it's just fun. Sometimes... I don't know if my art is art. <laughs> but I don't care. Because uh, I think I get to call it art. And then, you know, either people agree or they disagree. And that is just um, literally all of art history, so... kind of gone off the, um, away from the point. You're worthy of forgiveness, my friend. You're worthy of love. You're worthy to allow yourself to shine in the world. You are worthy of allowing yourself to shine in this world. You are so worthy of allowing yourself to shine in this world. The shiniest people are not the most perfect, okay? I think we all know that looking at celebrities. The shiniest people, the people who share the most of their light, are oftentimes not the most perfect. But that doesn't mean that they haven't done a lot of good sharing. It doesn't mean that they haven't been able to heal and help and nurture so many people with their lives and with their smiles and with their stories. But you don't need to be perfect to share your light. You just gotta be, you know, sorry <laughs> and ready to move on. Ready to make yourself better. And I believe you can make yourself better. I believe you can do it. You're forgiven. You are forgiven. You are forgiven. Okay? <laughs>